everybody, as per usual, this is a video showing off my acquired swag accessories from this year's PAX East. Not that much this time. The reason is because most of the stuff that you could get was like, pre-order our game and we'll give you a shirt, which is just dumb. So this is what I got for free. I just bit my tongue there. That really hurt. <laughs> I was just excited to show you what I got. First, as you can see right in the middle, watch out, we got a badass over here. Uh, that is from the game Lichdom. So I have two of those shirts to give away. We have a PAX lanyard. We have buttons from all over the place. Looks like some fan gamer and some men who wear many hats. Frog Dice gave us some dice and a little drinky majig. Magic the Gathering. We have the Evil Within. A poster set that I have no idea what those posters are of. I assume scary things, which is why I didn't open it. Could be a jump scare, so be careful when opening. Enermax gave me this uh, little fan here if you want to stick it in your computer. More men who wear many hats. Love those guys. Some Evolve wristbands. We have a DG2 magnet if you want to put that somewhere. And then, of course, the granddaddy of all the gifts, Wolfenstein. God bless Wolfenstein coming through to save the day. I have many, 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 many of these Wolfenstein bags to give away. I will do that whenever we do our contest. Probably sooner rather than later. That's literally... It. That's all the giveaway swag I acquired. Even I'm a little disappointed, but hopefully we'll get more E3 and then PAX Prime. We'll see. Anyway, let's see the kind of stuff that I got to keep for myself this year. This, as you can see, is the stuff that I got for myself. Uh, first off, a comic was given to me by a fan that features the Hot Pizza song because, damn, my tongue, man. Blah, blah, blah. I bit that thing and it hurts. Uh, go there to support them. I also received this wonderful necklace. It is a Rapture Anchor, and it was given to me by a fan, and I love all metalworking, so this is perfect. Then, oh, we should probably acknowledge that these two markers were stolen, mistakenly stolen, but stolen by me from fans that wanted me to sign stuff, and then I just accidentally kept the markers. I'm sorry, I promise you, they will have a good home. Then, Planescape Torment Dog. Uh-oh. This is a great game, and I suggest everyone in the world play it. I will. And Midnight Nation. From the creators of Babylon. You can't really see it. From the creators of Babylon 5 and Rising Stars. Comics, dude. Freaking comics. I'm excited. All right, then we have gauntlets. Gauntlet gloves. They are amazing. Like, here's the where you put your hand through. Hold on, can I do this really quick? Hold on. I probably should remove the ribbon. I don't know. Maybe I'm like, I'm Kabbalah now or something. Reverse angry Kabbalah. But this is my, these are my gauntlets. Thank you so much for making these. They're freaking awesome. All right, and I'm just going to leave this on. And then, the men who wear many hats gave me this award, this trophy, for being so bad at their games. <laughs> that now I have this awesome trophy and I'm going to keep it forever. Then, I got this bad boy. Pickups and Come Ons. It is the greatest book there ever was. It is wonderful, there's so much in here. This features incredible pickup lines like, you deserve a good spanking. And, I spent over a grand on Viagra today only to see you and realize I don't need it after all. Things that I don't think would ever work. All right, then I got these wonderful glasses to look super sexy in, which I did. You'll see those pictures shortly. Then, look, I got the pink one with the lollipop. How cute is that? With a little heart. The cutest, perfect, wonderful, love it. Next, we have my latest art acquisition signed by Tim Schafer. I was very excited about the meeting. I was all like, Tim, it's so nice to meet you. And he's like, who are you? And I was like, a fan. And he's like, good to know. And then shuffled me along my way. <laughs> We connected, I think. I think we really connected. And finally, one of the best things at the con, pwn meal. You might think gaming oatmeal? That is so stupid. No, my friends. A lot of people threw this out like idiots. Turns out inside of it was actually Cards Against Humanity cards with one of the best cards ever. Yep. 
You missed out if you tossed that and you thought it was just food. Oh, what a great joke. Anyway, guys, that's it. That's all the stuff that I got from the con this year. I had a blast. It was so much fun meeting all of you. And, as always, I have a lot of comments about what went down at the con and what games I saw. And so I hopefully will get to those, if not on the podcast, probably sometime this week in a Q&A. And uh, if you have any questions, let me know. I'll try and answer them. So, as always, to be continued. Space butterfly, space butterfly, watching the world as we take to the sky. Everything perfect, made by design. Kaleidoscope that was built by a mind, built by a mind, built by the mind of one lone soldier, hoping to find an army, army, an army of space butterflies. Now to destroy all.